So let's the review of Pixel Experience March update Android 11 on MI1. When I was trying to install it, I was facing many errors. The error was error applying the update 28, error 1 etc. I tried to update my recovery, use ADB side load, but still was facing the same problem. And the problem was the zip was corrupted. <laughs> And I was trying different method of installing the room like an idiot. So I just downloaded the room zip again and flashed it. So if you face the issue, now you know what to do. I will make a short video on how to install the room using ADB side load. So let's skip to the about phone. As you can see, the Android 11 is Android 11. The security device is of March 5 and the kernel is 4.9 kernel and has a power of plus kernel. Now let's see the customizations. As the room is based on stock room, you don't get many customizations. So a network and internet and mobile network, you get Volt and Volt is working fine. But you can see the LT logo in advance. You can see the Wi-Fi calling. Then in hotspot under the ring, you get Wi-Fi hotspot. In this you get USB under the ring, Bluetooth under the ring and Ethernet under the ring. And advance, you get SIM options. Then an absent notification, you get coloration. Then notifications, you get notification history. And notification bubbles and down here in this you get notification lock screen sensitive notification skip lock screen and in advance you get hide silent notification from status bar allow notifications snoozing suggested actions and replies notification dot on app icon blink light default notification sound swipe fingerprint for notification and download desktop mode then an apps notification you get notification screen time and in advance you get default app Voice manager, wireless MRC alert and special app access. Then in battery, you get battery saver. In this you get extreme battery saver. In this you get option like when to choose. See, ask every time, always use, never use. When you turn it on, all the third party apps get disabled. As you can see, as the name says, extreme battery saver. In this you can also choose the essential apps. Suppose Amazon. So when the battery server is on, you can use the Amazon. Let's turn it off. In this, you can set a schedule. In this, you get no schedule based on routine and based on percentage. And you get turn off when charged. In this, you get adaptive battery. Turn on light when charging. Battery percentage. And last full charge. In display, you get brightness control. Dark theme, night light, adaptive brightness. In styles of wallpaper. In wallpaper, you can choose the wallpaper. Then in style, you can choose the ascent color, font type, etc. And grid, you can choose the grid size. Then in advance, it's screen timeout, auto red screen. Here you also get option of lock screen. And this you get notification unlock screen, skip lock screen, add text unlock screen, show lockdown option, and wake screen for notification. Then you get device to wake and device in VR. In sound, you can choose the sounds. And down here you get live caption when you turn it on you can choose the language high profanity show sound label and live caption in volume control let's turn it off if the live caption is on it will use more battery then you get media in this you get show media player in quick settings in advance you can choose a ringtone and down here you get mi sound and answer when you turn it on you can choose the headphone type and a preset. Then in privacy, you get Porsche Manager. In this, you can allow or deny permission for certain apps. Then you get Show Password, not Notification Lock Screen, Device Personal Services, and Advanced. You get App Content, Auto Fill Google, Google Location History, Activity Control, Ad, Diagnostic, etc. In Location, you can allow location for certain apps. Then in Security. You get screen lock, fingerprint, as well as face unlock. And in screen lock. In pattern. You only get the option of 3 into 3 pattern. Then in system. You get gestures. In this, you get 5 fingerprint for notification. Quickly open the camera. System navigation. In this, you get gesture navigation and 3 button navigation. 
and gesture is working fine as you can see back button home button and reset button as you can see it's working fine and even in three button as you can see it's working fine then you get prevent ringing and power menu you get device control and sensitive content and system you also get option of buttons in this you get enable on screen navbar when you turn it off the hardware key is enable here you get hardware key customizations that is backlit for hardware keys home button action that is long press and double tap action and reset button that is short press and long press action but you don't get any option for back button customizations in the recents you get screenshot and select for clear all you have to go all the way back now let's see the manual camera is enabled or not that is the camera do you pay the enabled or not and start as you can see the camera do you pay is enabled now let's check the safety net and run test as you can see the safety net is passed in play store let's see the device is certified or not in play store and settings in about as you can see the device is certified now let's check the geekbench score the single core score is 169 and the multi core score is 981 in this you get stock launcher with customizations like notification dot at a glance adapt to home screen swipe to access google lab overization in suggestions you get suggestions in all app list suggestions on home screen and block apps allow home screen notification and about section in this you get the stock camera that is this default camera but it has many customizations it is not a normal camera as you can see there's tons of customizations i think it's snapdragon camera but of course you can install the gcam which i have installed as you can see now let's see the call is working or not 198 welcome to jio marathi sathi ek taba to continue in english press 2 as you can see the call is working fine and the rom is extremely smooth i didn't face any major bug the battery life is excellent i got around 6 hour to 7 hours in one time thank you so much for watching i'll meet you in the next one